24 hours from now, former President Donald Trump will be in the middle of a speech launching his 2024 presidential campaign at the Waco Regional Airport. Today, those close to the event are now expecting 20,000 attendees. Six News reporter Sydney Deshawn spoke with Congressman Pete Sessions about what he expects out of tomorrow. Sydney? Lindsay, it's going to be a pretty packed day as people all across the nation are coming into Waco for this event. People can start arriving at 8 a.m. for the event. Gates open at noon. Program activities are slated to begin at 2 p.m. and Trump will be expected to speak at 5 p.m. It's kind of like going to a Dallas Cowboy or Baylor Bear football game. For the first time in Waco history, former President Donald Trump is kicking off his 2024 presidential campaign. The city of Waco expects 15,000 attendees, but Congressman Sessions expects even more. We expect about five or 6,000, maybe a little bit more people. It is going to be crowded. The crowd can expect a day full of events. And it will offer people an opportunity as an all day event to come and mingle and talk and begin building their ideas about, yes, politics, but about our future, America's future and their children's future. The plane will land, the president will be greeted as he gets off the plane and the president will go and make his remarks. Session says Trump's main remarks will go hand in hand with economic opportunity. We disagree with the direction the country's headed, but with an agreement that we believe we ought to go back to allowing Texans and the country to succeed, have jobs, and be successful for our future. And that's the message that all Republican candidates, but in particular, President Trump will bring. Sessions encourages everyone to come out. I've been a member of Congress. I've been around this a lot. But it would be good for normal families and people to see how someone takes time to come sell their ideas, their message, and to gather the response from the crowd. Now tickets are first come, first serve, and they still are available. To get your tickets, you can visit our website, kcntv.com. All right, Sydney, thank you so much. The city, as she just reported, expects 15,000 plus people to attend this rally. So let's take a look at the city's traffic plan. The main entrance will be at Steinbeck Bend and Carl May. The intersection of Flat Rock Road and Skeet Eason Road will be an event exit only. West of the airport, Yankee Road will be the best way to access Flat Rock Road. If you come in from the east, expect to find officers at the intersection of China Spring Road, and Steinbeck Bend Drive. Also keep in mind airport road will be for northbound traffic only.